Barefoot running shoes. Hmm. The question is, how safe are they? Up next, why more and more health professionals are now becoming concerned about these shoes. Well, you need to know in just a few minutes. Sales of so-called barefoot running shoes have really taken off. In fact, a number of top shoe makers like Nike and New Balance are coming out with their own versions. However, a local physical therapist warns that these shoes are not for everyone. Use your arms. Bruce Wilk is a physical therapist and owner of the Runner's High Store in Kendall. Running injuries are common. Running injuries treated properly should not be disabling. But Wilk says he's seeing a growing number of injuries resulting from barefoot running shoes. Over time, the arches will collapse without being supported running on a flat, hard surface like asphalt. According to Wilk, these shoes lack the stability and support of a typical training shoe. Barefoot running took off when the book Born to Run became a bestseller in 2009. One of the first shoes marketed as a barefoot running shoe is Vibram's Five Fingers. I stumbled into these shoes. Miami resident Frank Alexander has been a trail runner for 35 years. He says he was disappointed when he tried the five finger shoes. You have to be careful because there's something that's lodged in between your toes because your toes are exposed in these shoes. They're not covered like a regular shoe. Alexander says he didn't get hurt wearing five fingers, but just go to the internet and you'll find published reports of plenty of others who claim they did. Injuries such as stress fractures and crippling knee pain. Stress fracture, running. Even former MSNBC commentator Keith Olbermann talked about being injured wearing five fingers on Late Night with David Letterman in May. These are the most wonderful shoes in the world to walk in. Mm -hmm. Unfortunately, if you try to run in them and you weigh more than 175 pounds, Oh. You will break something. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> this does not say this on the side of the box. No. Vibram, the company that makes five fingers, does, however, include this disclaimer on its website. Vibram recommends you consult your physician or a medical professional to see if natural running in five fingers is right for you. And Vibram also says five finger shoes are safe for running. The company is now reportedly funding some studies to prove it. They look really different.